what up my fellow Virgos we're gonna do a late night energy reading for you tap into the energy between you and the person that you're dealing with all right we're gonna see what's going on here um what I can tell you and what is the energy surrounding this relationship I've already shoved the cards I've already meditated over this energy and you already know what it is so let's just begin I like to thank everybody for those likes comments subscribes booking those personal readings and just being here and giving me that good energy all right um, you already know what it is, and if you don't already know what it is, don't force it. Don't force it to work for you. Let's see how Virgo is currently feeling. How Virgo is currently feeling. Those cards came out heavy, all right? Blue, 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 blue. With the tether energy, you may be feeling like you're real um, tethered. You may be feeling like there's still a cord, a connection between you and this person. Um, you could be getting a lot of intuition, a lot of dreams, a lot of downloads about this energy. You could be having real vivid, crazy dreams. I was just talking to my sister about um, my crazy dreams. I feel like that's a level of spiritual powers tapping in for you. Look out for the dreams. All right, you could be in the energy, how you're feeling, Virgo, having fun, clubbing, risky, fun with friends. You could be out there having fun with friends, okay, wanting to have fun with friends. Um, you could be feeling like this person is doing that with the trap, stuck, locked down, mental practice prison and captive yeah you could be i'm telling you you could be wanting to have fun wanting to um do stuff and be risky with friends but you feel like you're stuck a little stuck sluggish energy like you're trapped in a house looking out on the outside looking in looking out the window type energy stuck in something um running away emptiness feeling invisible and cutting off all right and i feel like you may be running away from this person um feeling a little empty because of this with the feeling invisible and cutting off you may be trying to make yourself invisible you may be trying to cut this person off all right and then we have fatality at the bottom differences divorce breakup and not looking back like that on that um let's see how this person is feeling about virgo how this person is currently feeling about virgo Muse, inspired by you, listening to music, emotional bond, strong lyrics. So you have tether in the first position, and this person has um, emotional bond in the first position. I feel like these are two similar cards, Virgo. I feel like you both are feeling that um, pull, tether, chord connection, emotional bond, uh, soul tie energy. Uh, heartstrings, getting strung along, get pregnant, entrapment, playing with feelings. This person feels like you're playing with, with their feelings, like you've been stringing them along. They may feel like you are going to cut them off and then come back to them and cut them off and come back to them. Like this is some game you're playing with their feelings. Um, they do feel like if they got you pregnant that they're entrapped in this now. They're, they're, um, or they wanted to entrap you with a pregnancy, take it as it resonates here. But this person does feel like uh, that you are playing with their feelings, okay? Justice, legal matters, court, uh, legal papers, divorce. This person at this point is thinking of the justice, all right? Thinking of um, legal matters, court visits. It's almost like if this person is not going through some type of divorce, some type of court, some type of legal matters, Virgo, uh, they're really thinking of their options here. Like if Virgo is never going to let me see them, I'm going to have to go through court to do something here. Maybe to see the children, maybe to do something here. They, they're wanting justice in some type of way. Um, how does this person feel about Virgo? They didn't come out. Single, independent, free from attachments, available to date. Then we have deja vu at the bottom. All right, so right now, if this person is feeling single as a Pringle, okay? Um, single as a Pringle, don't, don't, don't. I don't know what that's about, but um, take the roles as they resonate. I could be saying Virgo's person, and you resonate with uh, the energy down here and vice versa. So, you know, take it as it resonates. But somebody feels single and independent. They feel like they have no attachments. Um, they feel like they're available to date. Um, 
and they could be out on a prowl, okay? I heard out on a prowl. I also saw a jaguar stalking at night. This person may be going out at night um, looking for prey, <laughs> looking for victims. Ew, ew, gross. Um, there's something that this person is doing at night. They're up all night, nocturnal energy. Um, Virgo, what is the mutual energy between Virgo and this person? The mutual energy of this relationship between this person and Virgo. What is the mutual energy between this relationship between Virgo and this person? What is the mutual energy, Spirit? Concentration. Y'all both are concentrating on each other, period. Okay. Um with that Gemini energy, you could be both concentrating on um, thoughts of each other, impulsiveness. I feel like you both are in this impulsive energy. They may be impulsively trying to be out here being single and you may be impulsively cutting the fuck out, uh, locking the doors, um, trapping yourself type of energy. Uh, what's the energy between Virgo and this person? Mutual energy. Uh, manipulation okay so you both are manipulating you both are using your manipulation you are manipulating this uh this energy by pulling yourself away by cutting this person off by holding yourself back even though you feel this attachment to them they're manipulating this situation um by by feeling they're the ones who feel entrapped here so this person feels like um they're still entrapped here even though they're feeling single that's manipulation here like they have a duty responsibility but they are still out here single like i feel like this person wants to make it seem like they're your muse and um they're stuck here but on the other hand they are out here doing whatever they want single free Okay, living how they want to live. Okay, doing what they want to do. Mutual energy, way too many cards. All those flipped over, so I'm not going to take it. One more card for mutual energy between Virgo and this person. too many cards one more card spirit please one more card there it is publicity okay so i both i feel like you both are in the public eye here uh with publicity there's something that this person does in the public um virgo <laughs> and there's something that you do in the public and i feel like you're both seeing each other or something like that maybe you're watching each other on social media all right, let's tap into the tarot. See how this plays out. How is Virgo feeling about this person? With the tether card energy, what does Virgo truly feel about this person? Currently, presently, how do they feel about this person? The five of wands. It's all bad, okay? <laughs> it's all bad. Um, with the, the five of wands energy you are currently fighting off this soul tie this is not something you want to be connected to point by period this is not something you, you want to think about have dreams about uh dwell on too long but i feel like there's that dwelling energy here you're definitely thinking about them and with the five of wands energy i feel like this is a rivalry it's not good thoughts here it's, it's conflicting thoughts it's like how you're going to compete with them how you're going to uh, uh, how you gonna fight them, Virgo? It's like it's all bad. It's all I'm saying. All right, and the, with the Queen of Swords energy, yeah. All right, you have pulled your love back. Okay, pulled your energy back. You are no longer in love with this person. You are no longer willing to give them your love in any way. Um, matter of fact, you're fighting off those love energy to be in a more head over heart energy to be in a more productive energy Virgo how does Virgo feel about this person the empress and having fun fun with friends risky so Virgo you could be feeling um like this person is out partying and you to hold back here okay 
Uh, you could be feeling like you're pregnant so you can't go party. You can be feeling like you got to take care of children so you can't go have fun and party like this person does. Um, so who's the one really trapped? Um, anyways, but with the Queen, the Empress card here, I feel like you feel... Virgo, that you showed them unconditional love. That the Empress shows unconditional love. She uh, takes things and multiplies it. She takes love and multiplies it. I feel like you were willing to, at one point, take this love and multiply it. At one point, you were giving full abundant energy. At one point, you gave them your all here. All right. And with the Six of Swords, now you're transforming. No longer will you give anybody your all that doesn't deserve it. No, but no longer will you allow anybody to sweet talk you into doing some things here that that, that was ungodly, that, that isn't aligned with your spiritual beliefs, that, that isn't aligned with who you are and where you are and where you want to go. Um, that on that, Virgo, it's it's giving me uh, that if you, if somebody, I just heard, if, if you weren't pregnant right now, you'd be drinking. Um, I feel like you want to party okay you feel like you can't because of uh some type of love that you gave this person you're still holding on to something here something's conflicting with you um being out there and abundant and it could be the memories what happened with this person maybe virgo um maybe you were um real celibate you were uh real trapped in the house you were uh a uh, uh, keep to yourself type of person and this person got you got the empress to go out there and party this person got the empress to go out there and be of the world and it brought you nothing it brought you nothing to your abundance it brought you nothing to your life mm. trapped energy brought you nothing to your life I'm also getting the download, uh, the devil in my living room, um, the devil on my couch here, eight of cups energy, the devil on my couch. You may have, um, at one point allowed this person, the fun and the risky energy to get you off of your empress throne. You didn't see the devil on your couch. You didn't see the devil in front of you. Um, but now you see them. It's almost like a mask fell off this person. Okay, yeah, there was a level of impulsiveness with this uh, with this person that got you to be impulsive with them. Okay, this could have been what manipulation that got you to go out into the world, publicity. Okay. Anyways, with the trapped energy, we have the Eight of Cups. I feel like Virgo, King of Coins energy at the bottom. I feel with the trapped mental captive um, lockdown, I feel like now you... <laughs> Locking that coochie down, okay? Locking that wand down. I feel like you have walked away from allowing people to pull you back into the world. You, you've walked away from allowing the devil to tempt you. You've walked away from from mm, from wanting sex, from wanting party, to for wanting to take risks, from being impulsive, uh, Virgo, because that's only led you to be trapped. It's only led you uh, to fall off your path here. And with the Eight of Cups, I feel like you have walked away from this person, but you still feel mentally trapped. You feel still feel mentally stuck you still feel a level of captiveness um due to this relationship due to this person um lost energy five of coins lost yeah cutting off emptiness feeling invisible and cutting off i can't make this up um with the energy here i said when the lost card came out that you left them out in the cold you're cutting this person off you're making it so you're invisible from this person uh brogo it's giving me at one point you were giving them full empress lap you were giving them all your devotion you were giving them a full relationship status um not dealing with any anybody else uh real love here you you gave this person a chance at real love here and with the five of coins in this last card no more now you acting like they don't even exist okay <laughs> they don't even exist to you anymore uh they be like this person who somebody comes and talks about this person who now they dead they dead to me all right five of coins energy somebody is dead to you um somebody who's left way way out in the cold you let them freeze out in the cold for all you care um that on that virgo other people could be feeling like since you cut this person off you could be feeling depressed okay take it as it resonates here but i feel like uh, i'm getting more of once i gave you this empress love i gave you a chance i gave you that one chance you only get one shot do not miss your chance the blow it is opportunity is once in a 
lifetime. You better. So I feel like um, the music, the, 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 never let it go. Okay, calm down. Eminem playing hard. Um, I feel like at one point you gave them unconditional love. You gave them that Empress energy. And, uh, and then there was a point of a cutoff, Virgo. They, they did something that they just lost all love, okay? It lost it lost all trust. It lost all going backwards. It lost nah, none of that. You were only moving forward here with the Eight of Cups and the Five of Coins, leaving all that behind, okay? All that behind. Four of uh pinnacles energy king of coins you still feel like this person is holding on to you even though you've lost left them out in the past here yeah we have the world card and the ten of pinnacles virgo i feel like you're going to the next chapter like you, you, you moved on to the next chapter the world card you close it out and with the ten of pinnacles you are waiting for something bigger and better okay you are waiting for that huge contribution from the universe your real divine masculine your your real divine feminine the real person you're supposed to be with because you know this shit ain't it okay it's, it's giving it's giving this ain't it it never will be it um i'd rather wait i'd rather wait captive in my tower growing my hair out for god to send me somebody new than to go backwards to this boo boo the fool okay that's what type of energy i'm getting here take it as a resonates very well all right let's see how this person feels about you Virgo. let's see let's see let's see what's in their energy how they feel about the virgos i just heard a change in the tempo okay Yeah, you felt like your love was an opportunity that was once in a lifetime. You were never going to allow this person to have that same opportunity again. A mask fell off. And that on that, Virgo, uh, there's no going back from that. There's, <laughs> you already know who they are. Like, you already see them for who they are. There's, there's no going and pretending you're anything different ever. Uh, with the Muse cards, how does this person really feel about Virgo? King of Pentacles energy. Okay. Muse and King of Pentacles energy. I heard, and your love just makes me better. It makes me better. Okay. And the love just makes me better. It makes me better. There's something about this person that they felt like a level of abundance with you. They felt like they, they could provide for you. They felt like a level of security. They felt like the boss. They felt like, Virgo, you allowed them <laughs> you allowed them a level of sway, okay? You allowed them a level of um, influence into your life. It's almost like it was closest to a divine feminine that they ever had. It closest to somebody ever listening and, 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 <laughs> and falling in line with them that they ever had gave them a taste of 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 the king of pentacles you made them feel like a king like a boss in which your energy they felt like they could uh they could have uh abundance with you uh this type of muse this emotional bond here felt like they could they could create abundance with you all right um ten of cups i can't make it up long-term happiness inner happiness dream come to abundance where two families come together co-create and make something bigger and better somebody felt like mm, this was it they felt like um they hit the jackpot you, you don't miss your time to blow at, at the same time Virgo, I, i'm getting the energy that you felt the same way at the the one time this is your one shot do not miss your opportunity to go this opportunity is once in a lifetime you better okay i messed up the lyrics there but the point comes in where you knew this was an opportunity point blank period you felt that there was an opportunity with this person that's why they got the empress to go step out and do and do risky shit with them that's why they got the empress to 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 fall off her lane to fall off their throne for this person because there was a level of opportunity between you and this person that you both felt there was a, a publicity you knew this could be something great okay um with that king of pentacles energy they definitely felt like big daddy okay <laughs> big daddy home all right they felt like really heart strings let me shut up tower damn okay so now they're in this tower energy the spirit this person is experiencing towers yeah entrapment playing with feelings you're playing with their feelings and they're experiencing towers i can't make it up hermit card at the bottom 
okay? They directly see you playing with their feelings, not listening to them, uh, keeping yourself away, uh, cutting them off as towers, as broken foundations. They're going through it, Virgo, hot and heavy. Some of these emotions are really in it, okay? Um, while you're on the other hand in cutoff mode, because that's what Virgos do, okay? Look at the picture. They isolate themselves, boo boo. They go cut you the fuck off and pretend like you never existed. That's the Virgos. I feel like this person is a different type of earth sign, okay? Um, or, or they're just presenting in that suit. They're a different kind of sign than you, Virgo. They could be another Virgo, but uh, I feel like they're, they they handle things differently. This is the type of person who has feelings, okay? They express their feelings. They don't push away their feelings and isolate themselves from it like the Virgos. The Virgos can separate their feelings like a motherfucker, can't you? All right, feelings on this side, logic on that side, family on that side, and then divine up top. And you can just go between, cut things off, not look at those and blah, blah, blah. This person is uh stuck in their feelings all right they're stuck here um they're 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 being forced to see it they're being forced to fill it with these towers um they also could be with towers and justice system right next to each other baby they could actually be like experiencing karma okay they could be actually going through it virgo um let's see what this justice card energy how's this person feeling about virgo Yeah, five of wands in the justice system. <laughs> oh, okay. It's getting juicy now. You both have the five of wands for mutual feelings about each other. Y'all both are in a big old tiff, okay? Y'all both are in a big old fight with each other. This person may be feeling like they're going to have to fight the justice system, fight the legal system um, in order to not get a divorce, in order to see you, and to, in order to get into your energy. This could be um, literally spiritual law here as well. Um, spiritual... Mm, ancestors your guys may be kicking this people this person's ass all right um uh, they could be coming in with conflict this person could be literally going through a fight with the justice system or are being fought with the spiritual system either way virgo they feel like they're going to have to battle you in the legal system in the future or they're currently feeling like they're gonna have to do this um or they're feeling that they're going to have to fight for justice. Somebody wants to bring balance here, Virgo. They want to, um, is is giving, they want to have some type of truth. They want to fight to give some type of truth here. Okay, with the Four of Swords and the Ten of Cups to rejuvenate their family. Nine of Cups is their biggest wish. So to rejuvenate this Ten of Cups energy they once had with you is their biggest wish. It would give them so much satisfaction. They don't want to fight in the justice system. They don't want to take this to court. They don't want to uh, have to beg and plead. I will beg and plead for your sympathy. I don't mind because you mean that much to me. If I have to beg, and sweet darling, <laughs> please forgive me, girl. I, I don't like, oh, and then we have the Eight of Cups in the reverse, y'all. Okay, so mutual energy is lining up for each other. They're both feeling like y'all are a big old tip. Uh, but with the Eight of Cards coming out in the reverse for them and the Eight of Cards coming out on in the upright for you, Virgo, you're feeling like you have walked away, okay? You've already had it with a piece. You've already um, packed up your bags. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Don't care what you say. Dun, 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 dun. It's over. I'm leaving. Okay. I'm leaving. And then with this person here, <laughs> this ain't too proud to beg. <laughs> With the eight of cups coming out in the reverse, they want to they want to play like they single, okay? They want to feel like they have no attachments. They want to they want to play like they're available to the date to date Virgo, but it's giving me give me one reason to stay here, and I'll turn right back around, okay? With the eight of cups in reverse, this person is willing to walk backwards for you. They're willing to give this another chance. Again, they're willing to uh, try and try and try and try and try and try again. Um, 
which is kind of sad. Yeah, the star card at the bottom. They're willing to turn right back around to heal something. All right, they're willing to turn back right, right around to heal something with you because they see you as uh, this beautiful, abundant queen of wands energy, okay? Um, queen of pentacles, queen of wands energy. You're beautiful, abundant. You're independent, charismatic, passionate. You're also practical, stable, abundant, nurturing, domestic comforts. The whole nine, Virgo. And with the five of coins, uh, they feel like they left out into the cold, more synchronous in the energy they feel the heaviness of you letting them go and the six of uh the six of pentacles and the magician they want to give and receive they want to uh, uh uh open up a way to give to you so then they can manifest something new somebody here um they're not playing about you Virgo. they they uh they want to pretend <laughs> they want to pretend real heavy that they don't care but they do uh, real and they feelings again illuminated with the tower card. Real and they feelings. Okay. Clarify the five of wands energy for Virgos. Six of wands. Yeah. <laughs> All right, five of wands and six of wands. You're progressing here, Virgo. Then the seven of wands. Hold on, wait a minute. Five, six, seven, then we go on two-stepping. Hey, all right? Uh, two-stepping with your energy. With the five of wands, Virgo, you feel like if you fought this person, you would win, okay? <laughs> you already know. You already know if there was a fight between you, your ancestors, your guys, your favor, and this person that you would win. Hands down. It ain't no fight. I'm victorious. So <laughs> that on that it ain't no fight i am the one with the uh with the i will be the one who will win period um virgo you already know that you have a connection you're getting intuition you have downloads from your divine energy there there's energies around you telling you that you don't even have to do much and you'll be successful seven of wands can heal you blocking this person you already know what it is uh you could be on a blocking stream blocking them in all social media every number that they create every social uh I'm getting that this person is making fake numbers to hit you up from, okay? Fake emails. They may be sending you emails, uh, trying to get in your business, bro. Um, this is that type of person who you are blocking when they send you an email. You're blocking when they create another number to come get you, but you blocking that too. Um, it's the energy, bro. You're fighting this person because you know you will be successful in the end if you continue to block them, okay? You'll know you'll win, um, period. And I feel like that is confirmation for anybody who is scared of this person. Scared of the future. The full card, the Empress and the full card energy here. Yeah, I feel like Virgo, uh, with the Empress and the full card, you new beginnings. Um, you already know three of swords. Like I said, that you gave them that Empress love. And at, at one point you were all in. At one point you would give them chance and a chance and a chance just to see how they would move, just to see how they would treat you, just so they would get comfortable, so the mask will fall off, Virgo. And when it did, new beginning. Full card. It's all over. I'm telling you, they will never, ever, ever, ever get you to play the fool again. They will never, ever, 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 ever. <laughs> okay. I'm hearing somebody, I'm seeing somebody roll their neck as they swing their ponytail. Okay. Ever, 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 ever. Um, get you to, get you to do this shit again. Get you to take a risk again. You have learned your lessons from taking risks from this person. Period. Uh, God has showed you how the devil can come and attempt you in such a way that you can take a risk to teach you a lesson and you learn that lesson gracefully and now you're ready for the new beginnings like i said i would stay in this tower let my hair grow out like rapunzel before i go and uh go back to you i'll wait on a different person for years let me let me get out my feelings but i i tapped into those feelings Virgo. the three of swords is here and it was real heartbreak behind this it was real fucking pain behind this it was real grief behind this this ain't nothing you ever go play with again. You ain't gonna ever be boo boo the fool for this person again. Period. Eight of Cups energy. Mm. Four of Cups. I can't make it up. Withdrawing. Missing out. Again with a, you only got one shot. Do not miss your chance to blow. This opportunity is once in a lifetime. And they missed it. And they missed it. They missed the opportunity. And it's gone. Okay, it flew away in the wind. Never again. 
never again to have the same opportunity. They threw up mild spaghetti all over their sweater and they made themselves look like the fool. Moon card energy here. Now you're listening to your intuition. You know better. You, you are missing out on the illusions they're trying to cast on you. No, no, no. Okay, five of coins energy. Five of coins energy. We have the eight of swords. Okay, uh, mentally captive uh, with the eight of swords energy. Yeah, with the five of coins and the eight of swords energy, my ears are ringing. Oh, give me a second. Whew. Um, with the five of coins and the eight of swords energy, I just like got to download to change what I was about to say here. Um, Virgo, you, you were leaving the mental captive. You were leaving the, the, the mental prison that this person put you in the victim mentality. You're leaving them in their victim mentality out in the colds. You're leaving them in the, what they have to offer you out in the colds. Okay. Cutting off and feeling visible and running away. You are no longer being trapped by this person, leaving this all out, okay? And I love that energy here with the page of coins. There definitely could be uh, children in between y'all. Baby dad, baby, baby mama. There could be investments here. Um, that this person wants to have a breakthrough in negotiating you with you about, at least let's gather. At least let me gather with the children. Uh, Ten of Swords and the Nine of Swords, but they feel... Uh, Ten of Swords and the Nine of Swords, they're all that. Their chance is over here, Virgo. Um, it just keeps illuminating. Look, again, the World Card and the Seven of Wands, you have the chapters in it. You've blocked. It's, it's, it's no going back, okay? Um... No longer will you ever be fooled by this person, even if they heal, even if they change, even if they, even if you wanted to. My love, my love, my love, it keeps me strong. I feel like, Virgo, um, you won't change. I won't change, even if I tried. Even if I wanted to, you're no longer, you're not going to change from this energy because the love of the Lord, the love of the universe, the love of your spirit guides, your ancestors have shown you that, and they keep you strong here. They keep you going. They keep, they keep, they whisper little nothings in your ear telling you about bigger and greater things other than this person no longer. Okay. Let me, let me not preach tonight, but. Um, the Lord is keeping you strong here. I feel like you're going heavy into religion, heavy into your uh, spirituality, heavy into heavy into the occult. Okay, uh, just diving deep because you know that you are going to be um, waiting, healing, and moving on. This is a new chapter, so there has to be like a a cycle change. All right. Um, heavy on the music you could be listening to a lot of healing music tell me about how this person really feels about Virgo with the king of pentacles here oh we got a reversal the strength card in the reverse damn Okay, uh, with the strength card in the reverse, this person's having a lot of self doubt, insecurity, and fear. I tell you, I am not kidding. With the King of Pentacles coming out for the energy, you made them feel like that boss. You made them feel like Papa Daddy, Papa Smokes, Big Daddy in the house. And with the strength card in the reverse, they no longer feel in that energy. They're doubting themselves, they're doubting their power, they're doubting their strength, they're doubting their wealth, they're doubting their abilities, Virgo. You didn't got this person so far in their feelings, they are self conscious now. Ain't that about a bitch? I mean, whoop. <laughs> um, ain't that ain't that crazy? Um, <laughs> the eight of pinnacles. They are working hard to get back uh, feeling balanced. They're working hard to get back and feeling balanced and successful, Virgo. But it's hard work here. Okay, it's a, it's a lot of hard work here. Okay, being on this throne, having this position, they feel like they have a lot of responsibilities, Ace of Cups, and they feel like the since the new love, your love has ended, Virgo, they're just doubting themselves, doubting if they can hold this position, doubting if they were actually a, a, a divine masculine. Was I really? Was I really a boss? You you got this person so far in their feelings, they, they don't even know who they were anymore, Virgo. And their strength is real low. This person is very weak at the moment. You got me weak in the knees. I can hardly speak. 
You got me feeling like dun 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 dun. You got me weak in the knees and I can hardly speak. Oh, what's that song? Anyways, heavy on the music. Um, tower card. Oh, magician in the reverse. There go that manipulation. There go that manipulation. Okay, heavy on the manipulation. Virgo, they feel like you're manipulating them by um, I'm blocking and blocking them. So don't ever block, unblock this person again. Stand on your shit ten toes and stand there. Okay, keep on blocking them. Um, but the manipulation for this person, they could be feeling like you are manipulating towers in their lives. <laughs> They, they're feeling like you're giving them karma. What did I say about karma? They're get, they're feeling like uh, 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 um, their towers are coming in because they manipulated you. Because they created uh, illusions for you. Um, because there was a lack of faith. In, they have a lack of faith, a level of lack of faith now in themselves. Again, with the subconscious. At, this, at one point, Virgo, they felt like they could easily manifest things. At one point, they, could, they felt like their energy, they felt like, excuse me. At one point, Virgo, they felt like uh, they were in such an energy where they can manifest anything that they wanted here. And with the magician in the reverse, they're, they're no longer feeling this abundance, okay? They, they're feeling like these towers, you brought towers to their abundance, their manifestation energy. You brought towers to all of it just by you being single. Heavy on that hermit energy, just by you being single or independent, by you pulling back from them. Damn. Temperance. Oh yeah, they they know that you that you had angels around you, divine feminine. They know that you got them angels around you, got them them cold ancestors around you, uh, causing towers. You may have told this person at one point that your 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 ancestors, your guys destroy, uh huh. They either destroy your builds. Okay, and you got on the wrong side of the ancestors. Uh, Justice card energy. How do they feel about Virgo? Oh, a lot. King of Swords, Authorities. Four of Wands, the Ace of Wands, the Two of Wands, and a Chariot card. Yeah, they want a home house and whole, all that with you. They want the whole shebang. Um, with the Justice card and the Five of Wands and the Queen of King of Swords, this person could be feeling like Virgo. They're gonna have to fight the authorities if they come towards you. Period. Point blank. Um, I heard you a popo asshole. <laughs> Uh, you scary. Um, you may have threatened to call the police on this person. You may have called the police on this person. Um, it's giving me that they know they would have to fight off the justice system. It would be a fight with the authorities. This, the authorities could be your ancestors, your guides who are already in here bringing towers, whooping this person's ass. Okay, like I said, it could be spiritual law or physical law. They could either feel like you would call a real popo on them or the spiritual popo. Either ones is whooping the ass and they're scared of both. Um, Virgo, with the King of Swords energy, they want to be more disciplined. They want to, uh, to, 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 to stand in some type of truth and be able to separate from you because they don't want that. That smoke somebody does not want the smoke from the ancestors <laughs> hey, uh, they know about it right now um 37 37 on the clock at last card here with the eight of cups in the reverse uh has the person truly feel about virgo higher fit yeah give me one reason to stay here and I'll turn right back around. They're willing to do anything here. They feel like they're single. Uh, they want to make you feel like they're single out here, whatever. And they, uh, with the higher friend car here, somebody, baby, uh, wants higher commitment with you, okay? And with the higher friend card, it talks about um, religion. It talks about, um, it talks about somebody who is committal. It talks about somebody who is uh, will, willing to do that long-term energy now. They, Virgo, they're feeling like now that they're single, now that you're single, now that they see you single and independent, that now they're willing to turn around and come back and give you whatever they want. This is the type of person who does not want you to be in another relationship without them. They don't They don't want you going towards anybody else, having anything else, doing putting it down on, I'm here put it down on me put it down on me this person does not want you putting it down on anybody else here they, they, don't, they don't want you giving away any of that um and it's not theirs to be possessive about so 
Um, this is what I got here for the Virgos. This is the mutual energy between you. Like I said, take it as it resonates. You could be down here. They could be up here. Um... But this is what I got here. This is mutual energies for tonight. I hope that it resonated with you. And if it did, please give me a like, comment down below. Subscribe to the channel to see what's coming on next for the Virgos. And y'all already know, I'm very grateful and thankful for everybody watching. Peace.